Hey, it's Sam from Dan Talk, Real Talk, so let's talk. You know, sex when you're mad and sex when you're happy, it's the same. <laughs> okay, it's not the same, but it's the same, it comes from the same place. Your genitals don't know if you're pissed off or happy. All you know is that you feel passionate about something, and it's giving you that rush, that ooh, that whatever you want to call it. I know some of the best sex I've ever had has been after a fight, after a, a makeup, you know, you're trying to just, you know, and sometimes it wasn't even after, it was during the fight. So um, that kind of sex, it's hot. It's hot because it comes from a no holds barred, I'll do what I want, I'll take what I want, I'll push you down, whatever it takes, sex kind of thing going on. And it's cool. It's, um, it's freeing. It's exciting. It lets you tap into your inner animal. It lets you be who you really are without knowing that it's who you really are. And sometimes we all need that. I think we all need to get back to the fact that sometimes, more than we think, being animalistic really pays off. Go for what you want, do what you want. Be raw, be real, get it, do it, feel it, grab it. Don't hold back. When you think too much or you worry about what if, then you tend to take away from the excitement that is the moment and the moment that is defining how you feel right now when you have that rush and you're getting over and you're upset about something and your partner's upset you you've upset them however it goes down sometimes the best way to utilize that energy get horizontal stand up however you feel but do something to uh, diffuse that passion that you can use to a great result and a great end time Diane from Dan Talk, Real Talk. Next time you're mad, have great sex. I'll see you later. Have a wonderful night.